Hello, Lisette. Hi, Lisette. Hi, Lisette. Hello, Jacqueline Sosa. Hello, Veronica Castellón. Hi, Juani Figueroa. Hello, Jennifer de Reyes. Hi, Patricia. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome, welcome. Okay. Who can tell me what information do you remember from yesterday's class? What vocabulary, what information do you remember from yesterday's class? Yes? Yes? Jacqueline? Uh, Jacqueline, you have to take off the, the silence on your speaker, please. Thank you. Practicamos haciendo preguntas, mm -hmm. como por ejemplo, what's your father's name? Mm -hmm. Nosotros contestábamos mm -hmm. uh, para usar los, los eh, posesivos. That's my, correct. Mm -hmm. My, eh, he, mm -hmm. his para he y her para eh, she. Entonces se, con, right. se contestaba, eh, como el caso que mencioné, my, bueno, mm -hmm. sería en el caso del nombre del padre, mm -hmm. sería her name mm -hmm. is Jorge. Mm -hmm. His name is Jorge. His name, sí, uh -huh. para, perdón, his name is Jorge, para uh -huh. en el caso del, del masculino. That's y se preguntaba right. del boss, mm -hmm. eh, nightboard, tongue. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Mechanic, doctor. That's, mm -hmm, that's right. Y correct. en the alphabet, bueno, no sé si se dice así. El uh -huh. alfabeto lo comenzamos a, a, lo aprendimos y la canción también. Okay. El alfabeto. Okay. All right. Um, does anybody have any questions? Uh, referring to this information, do you have any questions uh, referring to any of this from yesterday's class? Any questions? Questions, questions? Preguntas sobre lo que vimos ayer? Good night, Alfredo. Good evening. El saludo sería good evening, guys. El despido es good night. Good evening. El saludo es good evening. Blanca, dígame Blanca, quítele silencio a su micrófono. Sí, buenas noches, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Eh, una consulta con respecto a la clase de ayer. Uh -huh. eh, como estuve estudiando eso, quería saber si para las respuestas que se hacen, uh -huh. eh, digamos como, what your husband name? Uh -huh. Lleva una, una S al final. Para la respuesta, se puede poner también, es necesario poner la S al final de eso. Para la respuesta. What's your husband's name? Eh, let me see. Denme un segundito, por favor, guys. Ok. Lo siento, chicos. Ok. Eh, la pregunta era sobre la S en el what's y sobre la S en el husband's. Ajá. Ok. Pero en la respuesta, pero ya en la respuesta, en la pregunta pasiva, pero ya en la respuesta también se puede, se tiene que poner, se tiene okay. que escribir. Vaya, en la respuesta tú vas a decir his Name is, digamos que se llama Mario. His name is Mario. 
¿verdad? O que si quieres decir, my husband, apóstrofe S, my husband's name is, y de ahí se va Mario. Por ejemplo, así, my husband's name is Mario, o his name is Mario. De las uh, dos formas lo puede escribir. Uh, ok, gracias, thank you. Ok, gracias Blanca por tu pregunta y ahí disculpe el, el, la interferencia. ¿Alguien más tiene otra consulta que me quisiera preguntar? Sobre lo que vimos el día de ayer. Ok. Today, eh, también el día de ayer estuvimos viendo el A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y and C. Now I know my ABCs. Next time won't you sing with me? All right. Everybody, I want to hear everybody. 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 Ready? Yes. Okay. Yes. One, yes. two, one, two, three. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, Q, R, S, 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 Okay. Vamos a escuchar a Juan Pablo. Ready, Pablo? One, two, three. A, B, C, D, A, C. Ok, Pablo, creo que tenemos que repasar. Vamos a ver Lisette Flores. Ok. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, M, N, O, P. L, M, N, O, P. L, N, O, P. L, M, N, O, P. Q, R, S. L, M, N, N, L, N, L, N, N, O, P. Ajá. Q, R, S, T, U, B. W, X. Y and C. No, I know my ABC. Next time, one you sing with me. Excellent, Miss Flores. <laughs> Thank you. Thank okay, you. Pablo, are you paying attention? Juan Pablo. Okay, yes. vamos con Alfredo Abarca. Hello. Okay, Alfredo, let me listen to you. A, B. Good evening. Good evening, welcome. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, A, B, C, D, E, K, L, M, N, O, P, O, P, Q, R, A, T, O, P, Q, no. Q, Q, R, A, C, U, B, W, X, Y, N, P. Now I know my ABC. Next time won't you sing with, with me. me. All right. Now 
let me have Jennifer de Reyes. Soy mala cantando. <laughs> you can say it. Okay. Dice. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, N, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, B, W, X, Y, and Z. No, I know what my A, B, C. Next time, won't you sing with me? All right. Good job, Jennifer. Okay, Amilcar Serrano. Tengo una pregunta. Dígame, Jennifer. La pronunciación de la Z, Z, así como, Z. como zumbido de abeja. That is correct. Z. Like if you're like a B, like a B. Perfect. Mm -hmm. Continue. Okay. Um, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, O, P, Q, R, S, T, V, W, X, Y, M, C, No, I, No, I, my A, B, C, Next time you want to sing with me. All right, perfect. Applause for the ABC. <laughs> okay, guys, now what we are going to do is we're going to watch the video about the ABC and then we're going to do a practice. Are you ready? We'll do this by listening and repeating. Let's get started. Um, on the screen, you can see the English alphabet. I would like for you to listen to me and observe the way I move my lips and my mouth for each letter. A, B, C, D. D e, e, F, A, B, C, G, F, H, 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 I, 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 K, L, K, K, L, 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 M, M, N, P, N, o, 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 P, P, R, Q, R, R, S S and repeat. It's recommended that you practice as many times as necessary. Ten at least. And make sure that you are pronouncing correctly. Listen and practice. A B A C B B B B C C C C B F D G F F H G I H J I K K L K M L N M O N P O Q B R Q S R Q R T S U S S that's J O E. Now let me go ahead and write that. Spell it out. That's J O 
E. Oh. My last name is Science. Okay. And let me go ahead and spell it out. That's S A E N Z. Spell the names of at least 10 folks. For example, your children, wife, parents, etc. I'll give a quick example of that. My daughter's name is Allison. That's A L L I S O N and record yourself. Okay, so this in this activity, guys, what you're going to do is you're going to ask and respond to the questions. Repeat, please. What's your first name? What's your name? What's your first name? What's your first name? My first name is Ruben. My first name is Ruben. Ana. How do you spell that? How do you spell that? That's spelled R What's your last name? What's your last name? My last name is Santos. How do you spell that? How do you spell that? How do you spell that? That S A N E O S. Ok, lo van a hacer así, como acabamos de practicar, pero lo van a hacer usando el first name y el last name. Ok, what's your first name? ¿Cuál es tu primer nombre? My first name My first is name. Rubén. Mi primer okay. nombre es Rubén. How do you spell How that? Do you spell that? ¿Cómo se deletrea eso? That's spelled R-U-B-E-N. Eso es deletreado R-U-B-E-N. What's your last name? ¿Cuál es tu apellido? My last name is Santos. Mi apellido es Santos. How do you spell that? ¿Cómo se deletrea eso? That's S A N T O S. Oh. Eso es S A N T O S. So, lo vamos a hacer con esta información que les acabo de dar. Okay. Con los ejemplos. Ya se los mandé todos al WhatsApp, ¿verdad? No se les he mandado al WhatsApp. Yes. No. Yes. 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 Ah, ok. Teacher nos puede enviar esas questions. Ya se las enviamos al WhatsApp. Ahí están en el WhatsApp. Y también se las voy a enviar aquí en el chat. Sí. Ok. Tengo una duda. Sí, dígame. Este, usted dijo eh, que el Santos era apellido. Correct. Porque dice más alive name. Ah, pero ¿dónde? O sea, ¿a dónde? ¿Cuál es el apellido? O sea, ¿dónde dice que es apellido? Ah, last, last name. name. Last name. La frase last, last name es apellido. First name es primer nombre. Gracias. Uh -huh. Así que van a preguntar acerca del 
la mother, el father, first y last name. Mother, first y last name. Teacher, first y last name. Son, first y last name. Daughter, first y last name. Todas con el first y el last name. Alfredo, ¿tiene pregunta? Sí, teacher. Y en el caso de segundo nombre, sería second name. Second name. Correct. That is correct. Second okay. name. Very good. Yes. Ok. ¿Alguna pregunta sobre la actividad que vamos a desarrollar en este momento? Ok. We're going to work in pairs. Ready? And action. Uh, Sara Carvajal va entrando. Okay, nos fuimos. Demole click, entrar. Demole click, entrar. Jennifer Blanca Delgado. Blanca Delgado. ¿Qué le pasó? Any children? Eh, quiero ver que sí. What's, what's, what's your daughter? Daughter's name? Daughter's name? Eh, um, I don't have any daughter. No tiene, ok. No, no tengo hijos. <ríe> bueno, eh, si quiere seguimos, me sigue preguntando usted, ahora sí, como... Vaya, yo le pregunto ahora. What sí. your first name? First name. Eh, ah, vamos a empezar, ¿verdad? Sí, My name, my first name is Sara. Okay. How do you spell that? Uh, that spelled is S A F A A R A. Okay. What's your last name? Okay. Uh, my, my last name is 
Carvajal. Okay. How do you spell that? That's C A R B A J A L. Okay. What your father's name? His name is with it with his name is Francisco. How do you is no how do you Expel, expel that. ¿Qué? ¿Cómo se deletrea Francisco? No. That's. Ahorita. De. F. R. R. A. M. C. Are you finished? Hello? Yes. Are you finished? Yes. Okay. Hello? Is, is everybody finished or not? Sí. No. no, okay. We are going to change partners. We are going to change partners. Do you understand? Do you understand? We are going to change partners. We are going to change partners. Partners. Vamos a cambiar pareja. Okay. Everybody repeat. We, we are, are, are going to, going to, going to, going to change, change partners. partners. We are going to change partners. We are going to change partners. We are going to change partners. Okay. Excellent. Any questions at this moment? Any questions at this moment? Uh, yo tengo una pregunta. Uh, ¿Cómo yes. se dice? Um, ¿Cuál es el nombre de su papá? What's your father's name? Okay. What's your father, father's, father's name? Eh, no veo que Patricia ingresó, tampoco Jacqueline, tampoco Lisette Palma. ¿A dónde están? Yo ingresé con Lisette Palma. Ah, ok. Ah, pues aquí sí. está Lisette Ingresamos Palma. con Lisette. Ajá, con sí. Lisette ingresamos. Mm, pero todavía están en la estación principal. 
nos sacaron ahorita. Uh -huh. Y ya ingresamos nuevamente. Nos metemos nuevamente. Sí. What's your last name? My last name is Mejia. Hey, how do you spell that? That M E J I. Repeat, repeat, repeat. M E J I A. Excellent, perfect. Thank. Hey, question me, please. What's your first name? My first name is Alfredo. How do you spell that? That is spell A L F R E D O. Alfredo. Okay. What's your last name? My last, my last name is Abarca. Abarca. Uh -huh. How do you spell that? That is spell A B A R C A. Abarca. Hey. Okay. Perfecto. Eso, es, eso es todo. O también lo de la mamá, papá. Uh, what's your father's name? His name is Luis. How do you? How do you spell that? That spell L U Ay, la I se me fue. Repeat, repeat. La I es I. Yeah. I. I, teacher. <laughs> Siempre me sorprende. Yeah. El... Hace rato los estoy escuchando. Uh, ah, bueno, felicita. <laughs> yeah. No, ¿cómo se deletrea okay. eso? Ok. M, L, M, I, L, I, N, D, I, Sí. Sí. Así es. Okay. What's your mother name? What? Mother uh, name. Is Her name is Elba. Um, how do you how do you feel that? Is that spell is E L V A? Okay. Uh, what's your teacher's name? Perdón. Si quiere cambiamos ahora, seguimos así, digamos, hoy pregunto yo y usted contesta para que practiquemos las dos. ¿Por dónde ah, vamos? ¿Por dónde vamos, sí. Sería. Sí. Ok. Vamos por... What's your... Daurer, name? Um, my daughter's name is Daniela. Permítame, vamos a ver, seguimos. J, U, A, N, A. Okay. What your teacher name? His name is 
Rubén. Okay. okay. How do you spell that? That's R U R R R R U B E N. Okay. What your song? What your song? I don't have. I don't have. Um, what you down tonight? Juan Pablo, ¿estás solo? Sí, estoy solo, por eso no sé, ahí me mandó a... Jennifer Reyes le había tocado. Ok, vamos con... Ahí está. Uh, how do you spell that? And the spell is uh, S-A-R-R-A-N-O. Um, what you, what's your mother last name? My mother last name is um, uh, Torres. How do you spell that? E-O-R-R-E-S. Uber's, Uber's name, no sé qué quiere decir, ¿sabe usted? What you, what you Uber's? Yo creo que el nombre de Uber y el taxi. Okay, Uber, Uber es el taxi. Oh. El taxi, ¿verdad? Ok. El, ah, el, el taxi, conductor sí, del Uber. Ah, ah, ok, gracias. El taxista. Es uh, Carlos. Ok. <laughs> How do you spell that? C A R L O S. Ok, creo que terminamos, ¿verdad? Terminamos. <risa> terminamos. Ya eso de la de Sear está un poquito así, ¿verdad? Cuesta un poco. <risa> sí, sí, la verdad es que hay que aprendérselo bien porque como que esa es la clave también para los demás, ¿verdad? Sí, sí. <risa> <risa> Hola. Yeah. All right. Let me have two volunteers raise your hand. Two volunteers raise your hand. Tengo una pregunta. Yes. En el listado de preguntas que usted nos envió, hay una, es la tercera, eh, contando de abajo hacia arriba, que es, what's your Uber's name? Eh, ¿A qué se refiere esto? Taxista. Eh, ah, correcto. No, no, ando perdida. Sí, Uber es un sistema de taxis. Ajá. So, Por teléfono. Ajá, Uber's name, digamos, el, 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 una X taxista. Ah, pero es que es muy amplio, está muy abierta la pregunta porque es un Uber, yo solo, ah, un Uber, un taxi. Lo ajá. que es usted. Cada quien ajá. tiene ya un Uber asignado, de su preferencia, hay unos que ya se contactan con ellos, por, de confianza. Ajá. Ahí no, ahí usted puede dar X nombres, o sea, Uber puede ser Mario, Debra, Pedro, Raúl, ah, okay. o sea, ahí está abierto a su criterio. Ah, ok. Yeah. Ok, let me have Amilcar and Alfredo. Amilcar, ask the question, Alfredo, respond to the question. No, que yo ni las tengo anotadas todas, ¿y usted? Gordi. Okay. Eh, Ana Mejía, ponga en silencio. Ya tú, sí, ya, ahorita. Micrófono, por favor, gracias. Hola, Amilcar. Hola, ¿cómo estás? Vale, empezamos. ¿Cuál es tu nombre? Mi nombre es Alfredo. ¿Cómo se llama eso? 
that is spelled A L F R E D O. Alfredo. Yes. Uh, what's your last name? My last name is Abarca. How do you spell that? That is spelled A B A R C A. Abarca. Um, what's your father's name? Her name is, his name is Porfirio. How do you spell that? That is spelled P O R F I R I O Porfirio. What's your mother's name? Her name is Blanca. What do you spell that? How do you spell that? Yes. How do you spell that? That is spelled B L A N C A. Blanca. Okay, stop right there. Now Alfredo asked the question and Amilcar respond to the question. Okay. Okay. What's your first name? My first name is Amilcar. How do you spell that? What's your last name? My last name is Serrano. How do you spell that? Um, the spell is um, S A E. R R A N O. Okay, what's your father's name? My father's name is uh, Ramon. Uh, repeat, please. My father's name is Ramon. Okay, how do you spell that? That uh, R R A N O N. Okay, Ramon. what's your what's your mother's name? My mother's name is uh, Cecilia. Hey, how do you spell that? The spell is C E C I L I A. Cecilia. Okay, perfect, excellent. Perfect. Good job. Continue. Alfredo and Amilcar. Okay, now I want Alfredo select somebody, please. And Amilcar select somebody, please. Jennifer. All right, Jennifer de Reyes and? Um, Lisette Flores. Lisette Flores, action. Okay, what's your okay. first name? My first name is Eva. How do you spell that? That is spell that is E B A. Okay. What's your last name? My life. My last name is Flores. How do you spell that? That is spell that. F L O R E S. Perfect. What's your father's name? His father's name is Cristobal. How His do you ask? father's name or my father's name? Como, no sé si usted dijo que podíamos usar el his o el my. Ajá, tú puedes decir his name. His name is. Pero no puedes decir his uh, father name is. Porque ahí estás diciendo el papá de él. Ah, uh, ok. 
Uh -huh. His Entonces, father's name. Ahí sería, his name is, o oh, my father's name is. Okay. His name is Cristobal. Okay. How do you spell that? That is spelled T R I S T O B A L. Okay, what's your mother name? Uh, her name is Evangelina. Okay, how do you spell that? E B A M G E L I N A. Okay. okay. Time. Now, vice versa. Lisette asks the questions and Jennifer respond. Okay. Okay. What's your first name? My first name is Jennifer. How do you spell that? That spell is J E N N I F E R. Okay. What's your last name? My last name is Reyes. How do you spell that? That spell is R E Y Y E S. Okay. Uh, what's your father's name? His name is Antonio. How do you spell that? Uh, that speed is A N T E N A I O. What's your mother's name? Uh, her name is Edith. How do you spell that? That speed is E D I T. Age. What your teacher's name? Uh, his name is Ruben Santos. How do you spell that? Uh, that script is R U B E N. Okay, thank you. Applause for the participants. Good job. <clears throat> okay, guys, now we are going to move on. And we're going to be looking at the following activity, which is coming from the platform. We're going to be looking at this section here. Knowledge check. Listen, please. Everybody, listen, please. How do you spell the names? Listen and check the correct answers. One. Your name is John Lee? That's right. And how do you spell your first name, Mr. Lee? It's J-O-N. Ok, thank you. Ok, ¿cuál de estas dos Two. está correcta? Sarah Brown. La primera. La primera. La primera. La primera. Correct. A-H? No, my name is spelled S-A-R-A. -A. La dos. I'm sorry, could you repeat that? La primera. Yes, La primera. it's S-A-R-A. -A. Got it, thanks. Three. My name is Stephen Jones. Thank you. Stephen. That's S-T-E-V. -V. No, it's spelled S-T-E-P-H-E-N. Oh, excuse me. S-T-E-P-H-E-N. Which That's one? That's right. 
Segunda. Number two. Segunda. Number two. Your name, please. It's Catherine Simpson. Is that K A T H E R I N E? No, it's K A T H R Y N. Oh, so it's K A T H R Y N. Number two. Segunda. Thank you. Segunda. Five. And what's your first name, please? It's Chris. Is your name spelled C H R I S? No, it's spelled K R I S. Chris with a K. Chris with a K. Number one. Primera. All right. Ding, ding, ding. <laughs> Correct. Applause. Everybody got a. Ten. Yes. 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 All right, you did it. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> All right, now what we're going to do is look at section 1.8 lesson objective by the end of this class you will learn how to form Ruby. statements and questions using the verb to be al final de esta clase ustedes aprenderán cómo formar oraciones y preguntas usando el verbo to be ser o estar. Listen, please. Tomar notas en su libreta, por favor. Okay. Hi, everyone. In this class, you'll learn how to form statements and questions using the verb to be. Let's get started by looking at the image on your screen. I would like to start by explaining the verb to be which corresponds to each pronoun. As you can see, towards the left hand side of the chart, you can see the pronoun I, that will be equals to M, for the pronouns you, we, and they, you're going to use R, and for the pronouns he, she, and it, then uh, we're going to use is. So, um, if we look at the examples, I'm Jennifer Miller. This is the same thing as saying, I am Jennifer Miller. You can see the meaning of those contractions towards the right-hand right side of the screen. Now, let's try to make sense of this by looking at the examples on the chart. I'm Jennifer Miller. You're in my class. She's in our class. Jennifer is in our class. He's over there. Stephen is over there. It's my math book. It's Miller. My last name is Miller. In order to understand this, you need to follow this particular rule that I'm going to display here um, on this document. Let me just change the size. One second. All right. Uh, and we're going to try to make sense of it, right? The subject uh, or pronoun is the first thing that we're going to have in order to form sentences. So, for example, I is the subject, and as we saw here, we can see that the verb to be to use whenever we use the pronoun or the subject I will be am. I am. And the complement is just other words that are used. So, for example, I am Joe. So we got a subject, the verb to be, and then some kind of complement. Uh, let's give a, another example. I, uh, the verb to be, I am. And what is the complement to that? I'm going to say an English teacher. Okay, let me give another example. Uh, now I'm going to um, give an example with he. He is the subject of our sentence, uh, and um, if you remember uh, for that, we're going to use the verb to be is. 
key is, and we're going to say uh, Mario, that's his name. Um, he, there we're going to say he is um, a mechanic. He is at work. Uh, let me go ahead and give an example with the pronoun they. Uh, and they are my co workers. Now let's learn how to form yes or no questions using the verb to be. Let's look at this example that, that you see here on this chart. Are you Stephen Carson? That's a question. The way you respond to that question is by saying yes I am or no I'm not. Uh, then there's one last question there, how are you? We're going to focus on forming this yes or no questions using the verb to be. As I explained previously, um, I'll show you how to form statements using the verb to be, where we use the subject, the verb to be, and the complement. Um, what we're going to do next is we're going to do we're going to follow something very similar, with the exception that we're going to form questions. So I'm going to copy this formula that I show you, and I'm going to paste it here, because I want you to see the relation between the two. What we're going to do essentially is we're going to move this verb to be before the pronoun. Okay, so basically guys what you're doing is that if you're making an affirmative statement you will start with the subject. You will start with the subject. I, he, she, they, it, we, after that, we have the be verb, am, is, are, and finally, we have the complement, Joe, an English teacher, Mario, a mechanic, at work, my co-workers. So, if I'm going to ask the question, Aquí dice, yo soy Joe. ¿Cómo voy a preguntar, soy Joe? Am I Joe? Am I Joe? That's right. Am I Joe? ¿Qué hice? Lo cambié de lugar. Right? Mm -hmm. Lo invertí. Cambié de lugar. Uh, el sujeto okay. con el verbo to be. Mm -hmm. Do you understand? Yes, understand. Yes. Okay. Yes. All right. Thank you, guys. Time's up. Time's up. We are going to stop right here. Remember, tomorrow is class. Mañana, mañana hay clase, mañana hay clase, mañana hay clase, mañana hay clase. <laughs> Do you understand? Yes. 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 Mañana hay clase, así que no me vayan a salir con que hay clase mañana, no, ya les estoy diciendo, hay clase mañana, All right. pero solamente es esta semana porque iniciamos el martes, ya la próxima semana ya solo sería de lunes a jueves, ok? Okay. 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 Mañana okay. hay clase, mañana hay clase. <laughs> bye, bye. 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 Bye.